if you have a problem with a routing, hopefully you can just touch the next one and it'll let you go there. Didn't even think of that. I wish support could have told me that. Guess what? I got an Amazon Flex order and it's from Awesome Whole Foods again. I have a total of five stops and I actually don't recall how much the earnings were, but I grabbed it instantly because I want the money. So far today, like right now it's 120. Earlier today, I did a few Instacart, Uber Eats, and a Grubhub. I drove a total of 42 miles and earned $73. So this afternoon trip is really gonna round out the day, and I'm looking forward to the earnings and the tips that come later. So join me on this journey, and you will get to ride along and see these five drop-offs, and then follow up with just how much money I make at the end with those tips. So let's go. Oh, and I forgot, my name is Russ. So glad you found me and welcome. I make videos to help drivers like you and that's grocery shopping, food delivery, Amazon Flex, it's all good. All right, let's get going. So I have five stops and I'm gonna say got it. So I'll be sharing all the addresses and personal information of the customer to my dash cam. That way if something happens later, I can go back and watch the footage. I also use the body camera this uh, awesome Osmo to document the delivery. So let's get going here. Thank you. I just pulled up. This is unique. This is not an Amazon store. It's just a random business that must have a dealings with Amazon. So I'm here to pick up two packages for a gentleman. Let's go see what they are. All right, how can I help? Um, the pickup location is closed here. Do you know the business name of where I'm supposed to go? I'll figure it out. Um, okay, because I don't see the address. Okay, do you know the name of the business or what it is? I don't see the address that you're I picked up from um, Whole Foods, dropped off the first delivery, and then it says pick up two packages here. Okay, that's good. But can you free up in my thing so I can do that? I'm going to make an annotation here in my end, okay? Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. And, okay. and then... So, thanks for driving with Amazon. Good morning now. Well, hold on. Will it do it automatically, or um, should I restart my app? Um, yeah, it's... A um, it will be removed, okay? I, I will, I want you to give us a call back after your delivery, okay? Yes, I will. All right, thank you. Okay, thanks for driving with Amazon. All right, bye. I don't know, that is so frustrating. The customer support is as bad as Uber Eats, DoorDash, it's the same type scenario. We're talking past each other. It's not very clear and it's not helpful. So I ended up coming back here to Whole Foods. Of course, they don't know anything. They said to call the driver support, which I did. So hopefully she will fix something in the app so I can uh, deliver the other groceries to the customers. All right, let's give it another shot. I'm gonna restart my phone you know, going above and beyond, not just restarting the app. I'm going to turn off my phone and turn it back on. Let's hope something good happened in there because uh, this is very frustrating. And if it doesn't work, then I think I'm going to try to get in there and manually figure out how to do the deliveries. And then I'm going to have to call them back like she said. This was not what I expected. So I've already wasted 45 minutes since that first drop off and the people's stuff in the trunk is there, and the back seat. Today's itinerary, nope, it's still there. All right, let's go to this location. Oh, interesting. Wouldn't that be something if I could have just done this on my own? I'm starting travel. <laughs> All right, I think I've helped myself. This is the first time I, I didn't know you could skip past a stop but it'd been nice if she could have told me that. All right, so we're delivering three packages. And it's this one here, the busy one. All right, and for the dash cam, we're going.
Thank you. That last drop off is complete. And now I'm gonna do the main bulk of the packages and it's a long distance delivery. Probably take me about 30 plus minutes to get there. So let's go drop off the packages in the trunk. Then I'm gonna call support and they're gonna figure out how to cancel that one stop. And, you know, I think up front in this video, I'm just gonna share that tip. You know what, if you have a problem with a routing, hopefully you can just touch the next one and it'll let you go there. Didn't even think of that. I wish support could have told me that. All right, let's get on the road and make these customers happy. All right, that last stop is done, thankfully. And now it's time to enjoy a nice refreshing drink. And let's call Amazon support and we'll close out the rest of this order. Hello, thank you for calling Amazon driver support. My name is, are you calling about an issue with a package? Yes, I need you to close out my order. Okay. Uh, you need help in closing up your orders. Do you mean packages, sir? Yes, um, there was a mistake in the app, and I called support before, and she said just to call back when I dropped off the order because there's a glitch in there. It wants me to pick up two packages that don't exist. Mm, okay, so there is two packages that is asking to be picked up, but it does, you don't have this. Right, um, I've, this I've finished... Exist. Right, I finished the deliveries. Mm, okay. Okay, so um, can you just provide me, sir, that shipping address you're seeing for those two packages? Okay, hold on, sir, because right now I'm checking. Does it this this two package shows is showing on your itinerary right now? Yes, it's saying to go pick them up. Because right now, sir, I am not seeing that on your itinerary. Can you try to refresh first your app, sir? So we can check if this um, packages um, were really assigned. Okay. Can you refresh your app right now? Yeah, I did it. I closed it. I'm opening it back up. So, okay. So as we're checking here, sir, your block already ended, correct? Yes, I'm done. Okay. Okay, yeah. So for this one, sir, you don't have to worry because right now I am submitting the form for you here. So... Um, our off-road will be informed, our off-road team will be informed regarding this and you'll just need to wait within 10 minutes so your app will be updated, okay? Okay. So kindly stay on the line while I'm processing this one, sir, okay? Okay. Thank you. And there you have it, customer service at its finest. I started off, as I mentioned before, I had about 47 miles that I had driven and I had earned $73 on the other apps. Now I'm sitting right at about 80 miles, so say 35 miles of driving, and I still have some miles to go home, but my original hope was I'd do food delivery and grocery shopping on the way so they wouldn't be dead miles. That's kind of changed now just because of the uh, issues that I had delivering today. But it remains to be seen on how much money I'll make. I know it'll still generally be worth it because I'll get tips plus the pay from Amazon Flex. You know, I can't take back time, can't change what happened, and that's just how it is. So I did waste 45 minutes waiting, trying to deal with this false pickup, and then finally now a few minutes of trying to call support and get some help. But overall, the trip was pretty good. It wasn't terrible. Um, I'm glad that this has only happened one time. Usually when I call support, they are helpful. Today, it was just very frustrating, and it was hot. My car said it was 90 degrees, and out here near the ocean, it's 84. So it's very frustrating. Share in the comments below, is something like this happened to you? Can you just skip and go to a different address or the next stop and skip one in Amazon Flex? I'm curious to see if that's possible. I'm used to the other food delivery apps where you kind of can't do that. I know you could do it on DoorDash, but not the others. So I do appreciate your feedback in the comments below. You know, and while we're at it sharing feedback, please let me know, what do you think of me? Do you think, do you think I did a good job, a bad job? Did I handle things well? 
How could I have handled it better? Please share. I'm curious. And I do want to do better. I don't want to be frustrated when I'm out delivering all the groceries and food deliveries, things like that. I want to be cheerful and give my best customer service to the customers. And even when there's times where I need help, I want to be helpful as well to the support agents. But I was a little frustrated today. I'll update here of how much money I ended up making with Amazon Flex, including any tips that came in. And since we're on the topic of Amazon Flex, I love anytime I can get these orders. So let's end this video on a really positive note. And you can watch this video next where I got up early and I got an early bird badge, an award from Amazon Flex. It went really well. I made a lot of money and it was early in the morning. So let's check that one out next.